this is a big victory for us. If you look at kind of where our sports teams as a university are as a whole, you know, we continue to, to make the NCAA finals. Here we finished 14th, uh, this year 25th, uh, two other appearances, uh, 16th and 19th. So every time we come, uh, you know, we're, we're contending at in, in some point uh, to be what, what our boss is looking for is a top 25 program. So, you know, we continue to do that year in and year out and uh, just trying to build on this success. We didn't get off to the best start um, as a team to the season, but we really uh, grinded and practiced hard at the end of the season to um, to get to where to get to nationals. Um, we we came third at conference to just give us a chance to play at regionals, um, and then we took advantage of being able to host the regionals and we came second. And obviously, we didn't have our best stuff this week, but we still beat a couple of good teams, and um, it's just always always good to make it to nationals. Uh, it means a lot, you know. Uh... Playing for UCA, make it to the national championship is always an accomplishment. Uh, we're always looking forward to do it, and we've done it two years in a row, so it's, it's, it's very nice. You know, between USO and Manuel, they've been in the lineup for, for four straight years. Um, they're guys who have been to practice every day. You know, there are no excuses to be there. There are no academic excuses. There are no illness excuses. Uh, they came on time every day. They, you know, not two necessarily vocal leaders, but amazing leaders, you know, by action. Um, academics were a priority to them and their family and I'm, I'm very, very proud of that. They've both done a terrific job in school um, and those are the people that we want to work with you know, day in and day out. They're great guys. They've been at UCF from the beginning and um, they were awesome to me when I came to UCF and um, it was awesome to get them back to another nationals after uh, last year and then the two years before that they didn't make it so it was good to get them to nationals for their last, for their last little run and um, we'll miss them. Uh, being into inside the top 30 in the country is always good for any sport, and um, you know, making making sure, like showing people what the UCF golf team can do, and um, in a country basis, playing against the best teams in the country, uh, I think it's it's good for everybody and for the university as well. And I'm really proud of representing the university here in this uh, in this event, and uh, hopefully the guys make it year after year. I'm very proud to be the coach at UCF. You know, where Orlando is is the home of golf. You know, in in the United States. Um, you know, we've got great year-round weather, we've got great facilities, uh, we've got some amazing su people supporting our program financially, uh, we've got a great administration, uh, golf clubs in town that are doing a lot for us, so you know, we continue to make strides in the right direction, um, and I think if we, we can continue to do this each week, um, recruits are going to notice and we're going to continue to get better.